All right, well, welcome back to Let's Blind Solve Portal 2. Uh, before we do anything else, by popular request in the thread. Oh, yeah. We are going to try... I was hoping try... that people would allow this. Uh, well, it's, we'll see how it goes. There's definitely some jokes we would have missed if it uh, hadn't been for the subtitles. But we'll see how this goes. All right, we are armed with our potato GLaDOS and ready to roll. When we that last quite left our hero, we had just gotten down to uh, the 1980s test chambers. Sorry, were you saying something? Oh no, just that is a lot of goo. It is. It's a it's a veritable waterfall of white paint. I'm gonna get up there, maybe. This is interesting. This is one of the few puzzles that I remember, actually, so left a, left a lasting impression on me. Okay, so where can we put a second portal? Because there's I don't even see any other portalable surfaces. Wait, maybe if we do something like this? Yeah, okay. Oh, huh. Oh, interesting. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Huh. Well, let's find oh. out. So it's got a trajectory. That's good to know. Okay, let's uh, cut this out for a moment. So GLaDOS isn't making fun of you, even though she's permanently attached to you. Is that oh. just because she doesn't have the processing power? Yeah, speaking of which... I went back and was rewatching some of the videos to make sure that, you know, they uploaded to YouTube okay and all that kind of stuff. And in one of the very first mm -hmm. ones, we got the announcer, he something, says something like, all Aperture personality constructs are programmed to survive as voltages as low as 1.1 or something like that. Oh, that's funny. Like, and she's like, I've got only one volt. Yeah, they actually specifically mentioned the voltage that she has. Okay, this was almost certainly not what I was supposed to do. Where else can I put a portal? Why don't you cover yourself with the white goo and then put a portal on yourself? Done. Well, first step, done. <laughs> okay. Those are non-portal, yeah, okay. Uh, darn it, if I hadn't jumped down, I might have been able to bounce my way up there. That yep, was... time to kill yourself. Oh! I'm so stupid! <laughs> Where can I put a portal? I wondered. Right. And the answer is? Anywhere I want. Anywhere! Yes. Isn't that so cool? I thought that was really clever. Yeah, actually, and that, you can see, even though I knew exactly what the gel did, it took me a long time to wrap my head around what that actually meant in terms of puzzle solving. That's kind of impressive. Well, I hate to say it, but you're still a long shot from solving this puzzle. Yeah, I know, but now I'm... <laughs> Man, it's not even thinking... But we had our first anymore. breakthrough. Yeah. Okay, so I'm clearly gonna want to... Coat that surface, because that is a launch pad if I've ever seen one. Alright. Okay. I don't now I don't know how I'm gonna get the momentum necessary to fling myself off of that yet, but I That's can how I solve all these portal puzzles. So you just like say this is probably a component of it. Yeah. I don't have no, the full you... solution in my head. But you definitely learn to recognize the elements when you see them. Okay. If I just jumped down from there, that would almost certainly not give me enough. But you know what? Let's double check. Yeah, okay. But what if I send some goo out that way? I wonder what will happen. I genuinely don't know. Not very much useful. Huh. 
goes very high. But we need to coat more different surfaces. We're trying to get, to get your momentum really high, right? Yeah, I want to... If I can get myself up higher, that will help quite a lot. Um, Like up there. Labeled 01 and 02. Well, what if... Oh, come on. There we go. Oh. That's cool. Yeah, I don't know if this will get me anywhere I want to be, but let's find out. It'll at least be a cool-looking vantage point. Yeah. Oh, no, that definitely gets me higher. Okay. Um. All right. Made it up here. This might now be high enough to fling myself from there if I have a good point to jump off of. Oh, and come on. <laughs> I can make this. I can do... No, shit. Okay, fine. <laughs> uh, so well, it was close, almost, a, almost a complete idea. It's not quite. You're so close. I want to coat this stuff right in the middle here. <laughs> I wonder if anybody's modded this game so that you could have a gun that shoots out the gels. Like, huh, you could just have a whole bunch of different weapons, so you could have, like, a, a gun that shoots okay. blue gel and... Complete. All right. Pseudo complete. One there. And one there. So some Although surfaces, the in fact, angling they... angling on that what? is going to be interesting. The angle at which you sent that blue portal is going to be interesting. Or the orange one, whatever the second well, one is. Well, Asha is about to comment on that. Check this out. There are some surfaces where they auto-orient your portals. Oh, interesting. And I had yeah, noticed I this earlier notice. and commented on it and thought it was a change for the entire game. But it's not quite. There's just some places where it does that. Because I guess it would be very difficult to solve otherwise. White out. What interesting. Life gives I, you lemons. Lemon. Don't make lemonade. Yeah. Make life. Make take life. the lemons back. Yeah. Get mad. Yeah. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. <laughs> make life rule the day. It thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemons. Oh, like I'm gonna get my engineers <laughs> to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> Finding people, he says what we're all thinking. The point is, if we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping, artificial intelligence, we should have been working on it 30 years ago. But I will say this, and I'm going to say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <coughs> now she'll argue. She'll say she can't. She's modest like that, but you make her. <coughs> oh dear. I'll put her in my computer. I don't care. Right, okay. <coughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. And there's the other half of the story. Man, we made a mess out of this testing chamber. <laughs> anyway. Interesting. Music. Oh, it's all like what the 80s thought the future should look like. That was a cool little GLaDOS origin story. I thought it was neat of them to do something like that. Yeah. What Elevator part of that was surface? new for you, by the way? You said uh, it was the other half of the story. How, well, so we had worked out that GLaDOS was Carolyn, but we had not worked out how she got in from Carolyn to GLaDOS. Yeah, makes sense. Wow, that Whoa. worked. 
I thought that was wishful thinking. <laughs> well, they did remind me of the zoom function. Oh, interesting. Oh, interesting. Um, okay. What's the worst that could happen? How much farther? 29, 25, 20. Okay, so we are almost three kilometers below the surface here. Interesting. We are gonna have to hear from Wheatley again soon, because uh, yeah, we appear to, have, time. appear to have found a functional surface elevator uh, with one minor flaw. <laughs> Admitted that it doesn't function. That it doesn't <laughs> function. <laughs> well, other than that. Other than that, it's a totally functioning surface elevator. Yes. Uh... I could imagine a world where a testing facility like this does exist um, in present day or in the near future, but it wouldn't be in the name of science or research. It would be a reality TV show or a game huh. show. So my friend actually was just doing... Um, my friend uh, is a physics grad student currently working at a laboratory uh, buried a mile beneath the earth in the Italian mountains. Wow. That's so neat. not quite this deep, but uh, his working day does begin with him... Why am I still looking for something there? With him descending, you know, a mile into the bowels of the earth before doing, like, dark matter research. What am I trying that... to find? What am I doing? I'm just kind of idly shooting portals up. Sorry, what were you going to say? No, is that, is that for, like... Secrecy, oh. or is it for security of the project, or does the project require uh, it's so that underground they, research? The last one. It's so that they avoid like cosmic rays and stuff. Oh, uh, god damn it! That was pretty close. Oh, ow! <laughs> one more time. I can do it. Ha! Oh, this is interesting. Okay. So I have to keep slingshotting myself, huh? Higher and higher. I think I will have better luck if I go over there. Ah, damn it. Oh, well. Oops. Damn it. Not quite. Oh, I guess they just want us to do this. Let's try that. I don't know where I'm supposed to be jumping to. Like, what am I trying to land on? Oh, that. That's what I'm trying to land on. Okay. Didn't work out very well. Or did it? Oh, it did. Yeah. Sorry. No, I'm not missing the obvious exit door twice. <laughs> Interesting that they only had one real puzzle with the white gel. I highly doubt that will be the well, case. Well, they only had one training puzzle. They had multiple training puzzles for both of the other two. Okay. I know where... Facebook break, but that crazy man down there was right. Let's not take these lemons. We are going to march right back upstairs and make him put me back in my body. But he'll probably kill us because he's incredibly powerful and I have no plan. Well, I'm not going to lie to you. The odds are a million to one and that's with some generous rounding. Still, <laughs> let's get mad. If we're going to explode, let's at least explode with some dignity. Noted. I love okay. how GLaDOS is, like, the good guy now. And, like, well, you're sort of rooting for her. Just eh. a little bit. Like, you can't help but root for her a little bit right now. <laughs> Did that work? Oh, shit, no. I also want to shoot an orange one. Okay. Um, I assume this is more of the... Oh! Like that. Cool.
Nope, not a puzzle related to how well can I jump. Well, that's good. Um... Hmm. Ah! Oh, interesting. We are getting precarious now. Let's see what happens if I do this. Where am I going? Here. I'm Clever. going here. Yeah, it's not so obvious what things you can stand on anymore, huh? Okay, and this is portable? Yes, it is. Yup! Man, I accidentally solved that puzzle. Good for me. All right, let's do this. Geronimo! Boing. Yes! <laughs> Caution. Noted. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, ooh, ooh. I wonder if they were playtesting and a bunch of people fell down that hole without looking, so they're like, we should <laughs> put a big caution sign here. Clearly. And... Oh, yeah, okay. So I'm not going to get in through there. Where else? So I've got blue. I can get blue up here if I need it. Um, wonder what I can see. Ah, that's a way in. Huh, how do I get myself up there? Wait a second, what color? Oh, I don't have anything on the blue right now. Let's see. Oh, is it not dripping anymore? Oh. No, it's... No, it's not. The drip's over. No more drip. Oh, really? Yeah. Weird. Well, sort of. That's the first time we've seen that before. Well, it was... Yeah, I guess just for that one puzzle. All right. Um... But flinging myself up here doesn't actually help me. I need to get in from that side somehow. Um... No, of course you're not going to let me cheat or anything easy like that. Okay. Well, all right. Let's see what happens if I jump Nothing from a great... Lose. What? Nothing to lose. Yeah, though I need to figure out where I can drop onto now that has a surface. Um... Why does that have a railing? I'm I missing I love how something. massive this puzzle is. Yeah, and I'm it's missing massive something. massive and vertical. Which is really interesting. Nope, can't climb the rock. Oh, is there something up there I can portal to? No. It does sort of look like it would be. But no. Yeah, but I think those are lights. Huh. What's the approach to get up there? I think Do you have the, a plan? No, I don't have a plan. I don't know what the approach is. We can't get in from that side because the whole wall is blocked off. So how about the other side? This side is open, but I don't see any way to jump up because this entire thing is a grate. Um, well, there's four sides. How about yep. the other two? There's that little ledge there, but I don't know how to get... Wait, what was that up there? Is that just a sign saying gel flow in this direction? There's that balcony... Um, but again, there's nowhere over on that side to send ourselves in from. How about just keep walking straight? Like this? The fourth and, fin fourth and final side. Is there an approach from this side? Hmm. There's some gel oh, there's something down. else up there. There's a whole other shaft. Check your zoom. Though. 
I definitely hadn't noticed it. Uh, what about, um... Well, yeah, see if you can get a portal on there. But what about that room where we could see the, the gel dripping? Like, through there? Yeah, I assume that's where we're trying to get to and via this bridge by getting ourselves up onto here. Um, but maybe that's wrong. Maybe I shouldn't be assuming that. Huh. I'm really confused about that one portable floor over there. I don't know why there why that exists. It doesn't seem to be it doesn't seem to open up any useful things because it's pointed straight up and is there a run button? No. There's this is the I'm one I'm surprised that that blue gel turned off. That doesn't make any sense to me. Yeah, well, let's Okay, let's see. Blue gel was down there. Definitely not dripping. Um. Uh, damn it. I feel like the obvious solution is to somehow get up from here onto there and then walk across. And then we'll come out the top there and keep going up that shaft. Is there any way to get your momentum up so that when you jump off this edge here, you're catapulted up even higher onto the second ledge? Like a really, really long jump? Or that probably wouldn't do it, because well, you'd only ever get as high as where you started. You wouldn't ever get higher, right? Yeah, I guess that's also true. Also, there's nowhere else to put portals up here. And there's no white... Unless, unless you landed on the blue gel... And then landed on the port now. But even the blue gel's directly you know. under this, and, you know, you can't put a portal on the rail, on the grating. Um. Hmm. I'm assuming I haven't made any obvious misstep, because right up till now, there's only really ever been one possible solution, one possible next step at any time. I see more blue gel dripping. I see more white gel dripping. That's glass. I definitely can't shoot anything through there, okay. Yeah, that white gel would be super clutch right now. Yeah. Okay. If I drop off of here, I can't easily land on anything. I've got this hole, but there's nothing directly underneath it. When I sent myself out of that one, I bounced off of the blue, and I ran into... I landed against this railing, basically. So there's no place I could have put a portal to intercept that. Yeah. Why is this here? This has got to be important somehow. Oh! Because if I jump up through here, I might see a portal surface on the floor of there. That's it. Okay. Let's now I go. just need to find a way to get some good vertical motion. See, this further supports my theory that when you see something interesting, without understanding it, you should just try and interact with it. <laughs> yup. Oh, wait, shit. Oh, well, whatever. Still works. Yup. Ha! Fascinating. Okay. Yeah, you showed that guy who's boss. Good puzzle. Ooh, that was good. That was really good. All right, so that door is mainly interesting because we can't shoot portals out through it. So we want to get up there, I think, because that corresponds to what we saw before. So if we could get white gel over here, we could fling ourselves up onto it. Sensible. There's two drips of blue. Where's the other one dripping onto? Up there, okay. Um, and we've got orange. Oh, okay. They're finally all coming together. Okay. This is very exciting. Because we can't... Is this the first time we've seen all three gels together? I think yes. It is. I mean, it's only the second time we've seen white gel in a, you know, puzzle context at all. 
Now, now that's got no trajectory. It's just going straight down. So if we wanted to coat a surface, where else can we put portals other than where the gel is falling? Are there any other portalable surfaces in here? What's all this stuff out here? Well, everywhere that there's white is a portal portalable surface. What do you mean everywhere that there's white? Well, anywhere that you manage to make the right. white gel hit. But which is where? Just that spot. Okay, I mean, well, let's see what happens if I just put the other one here. What happens? Cats and dogs living together. Right. White gel. Madness. Oh, hey, there's something up there. Ah! Ha ha ha! That's Useful. Helpful. All right. Okay. So what's the end game? Because there's a, a lot of different things you could do here. Yeah, there are two options. One is actually here. This is easy. I pull orange. That was blue. I pull orange out like this. No. Ooh, order of operations becomes important because once the white goes away. All right. Okay. That looks good. Right. Okay. And now, if I wonder what, this may be too simple. I may not. I may like, because there's a gap there. So let's see what happens. But we'll probably learn something. Ah. Oh, that's a clever idea. Yeah, okay, I didn't do that. That was actually automatic, because there's a little bit of a dip there. Oh, interesting. That would have been hard <laughs> to solve almost. <laughs> Alright. Alright. That's a this good is... evil laugh. Have you been working on that? Oh, uh, sort of. <laughs> it sounds good. Thank you. Now that <laughs> is not portal. <laughs> Gotta get some more blue right there. Like so. Oh. Oh, multiple steps. Check that out. Check out how many steps there are. <laughs> You're so clever. Check out how many steps. This is these are the, fun. These are the best kind of puzzles when they're challenging, but you also get them right away. So you get all the satisfaction of solving a puzzle quickly, but you know in your in your heart of hearts that it was a difficult puzzle uh -huh. that you solved quickly. It's like the best feeling when it all comes all together right. like that. And now we have set ourselves up to do something awesome. I'm Let's ready. Go. We're gonna yeah. cut out the last five seconds of video, and now we are <laughs> set up to do something awesome. Let's go. Dude, this is gonna be so awesome. We boingy 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 boingy. Wait, I'm not where I. Oh, but now I can maybe see something. No. Interesting. That's not what I expected. There's really nothing. I must be missing something. Oh, hey, there's thing around over here. Ah, yep, I was missing something. Okay, cool. What can I usefully do? I want to get right there. There's nowhere up there to put a portal. Okay. I don't want to ruin all that. Hang on. What do you mean ruin it? I uh, so it's so carefully set up. <laughs> okay. I wonder. Where can I make that pour out of? Theoretically, I want to get it somewhere up in there. All right. But that first requires some sort of 
portable surface. No. Obviously not. Uh. Huh, just when I thought the puzzle was over. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Why are you sending the portal gel all the way over there? Oh, I'm not. It's just that's a convenient place to put the second portal. I'm just trying to figure out where else I can send the portal. Like, how about right there? Fucking Christ, man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was pretty dumb. Not an exit door. Okay. Fun. Whoa, is this... Okay, it's got real. It's good. Moon paint everywhere! I'm gonna temporarily turn off the moon paint. What? Having perspective issues here. I don't know what's going on. Where what? is gravity? Yeah, where is? That's a good... Oh, wait. Oh, I hit the wrong one. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> wrong portal. That was the problem. Huh. Okay. We uh, need more... Need more gel. Wait. Wait. Orange. <laughs> okay. This is a hell of a thing. Yeah, perspective is really tricky at this point. That's orange. How much have you ascended here? It feels like a thousand meters. Okay. okay, so this way is up. Oh, that's clever that they put all those signs everywhere just so that you would know. Oh, shit! That's... <laughs> that way wasn't up. Oh, gosh. Wow. This is confusing. I know. Oh, I can climb this. I don't think you're climbing it. I think you're just distort disoriented. I have absolutely no idea. Hey, that looks like a wall. Wee! You did it! I don't know what I did. Puzzle. I really don't know what I did. Okay, that's where I was. Oh my god, that was trippy as hell. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Ah, oh. all right. Let's call that a video and then uh, keep going. Okay. Shall we? I mean, where are we? Like, what's happening? Not here? the Have slightest we... fucking clue, man. But Just I know walk which until way we get is to up. The next room, right? I know which or way no, is up. Think... Nope. All Cliffhanger. Right. Okay. Because I know how much you love those. You talked me into it. <laughs> All right. Cool. See you guys next time.